Muskies are great visual fly rod fish and very catchable too once you crack the code. But you'd sure never know it if you consulted the IGFA record book. Only a few have ever even been recorded. I'm going to share with you what I've discovered about catching muskies on flies that are sure to tip the odds in your favor. Big flies are great later on in the season, but now a 2 aught rabbit strip Dahlberg diver enhanced with flashaboo is my absolute number one producer and rigged with a 20 pound nylon coated wire shocker. We're going to come into two different kinds of fish. Belly to the bottom, which I think are pretty darn catchable, and other fish that are suspended up high. A little bit more difficult to catch. There are two totally different triggering techniques that work on muskies depending on whether their belly's on the bottom or they're up high. Come into each area quietly and with your eyes peeled. The suspended fish can be hard to see, but once you locate them, they're usually most susceptible to a diver fished on a floating line. Tease them with it, almost like you would be twitching a minnow bait. The belly to the bottom fish are best triggered on a diver fished with a wet tip line. Use a leader the same length as the depth of the water that you're fishing. That way you can make the diver pop on the surface, dive and contact the bottom, then swim all the way back to the surface. This really drives fish crazy. Focus your efforts in four to ten feet of water. Be sure to check narrows, saddles between islands, bays, and shelves or corners on steep sided banks. Look for areas that collect warm water. 63. There's a musky right there. See it? Yep. She's facing him. It's coming. 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 Got him. Got him. All right. Oh, oh man. It's a big musky. It's the biggest musky I've ever hooked up. Get the line untangle, oh Lord. And this is big, big, big. Can you see the grip size of it? The line's oh. going to be shaking oh, my and heart. Heart. Oh, My heart is beating 600 miles an hour. And she was set up exactly, exactly the way we were talking about, man. Big fish, Larry. Whoa. Okay, good, 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 good. I don't want to be that far away. That's good. Let's bring her into shallow water. Bring her into shot fish. Look at her. Just burning. Here, give me another battery. 12 pound tip it on. Oh. oh, don't come off. Don't break. Don't come off. Don't fray loose. Line don't break. Hook don't straighten. Jaw don't turn. Barb don't crush. Go with her. Oh, she beautiful. Oh, man. What a gorgeous fish. Mr. Cradle, are we ready? <laughs> Here she comes. Beat. Oh, man. Oh, fell out, barely hooked. Does this look like a musky bait? Well, it did to this musky. Hey, is a musky a fish of 10,000 casts? It can be if you're where there aren't any or you're throwing what they don't like to eat. You do just exactly what I showed you today, and I guarantee that you can come up here with a fly rod whoa, and catch a big musky. Just give Don a call. Here's his number. Woo. <laughs>